we made it very clear in the course of the conversation that the priority was to pass the DREAM Act, she said at a press briefing. Obviously it has to be bipartisan. The president supports that, he would sign it. But we have to get it passed. Democrats are pushing for the bill, called the DREAM Act, after Trump rescinded the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals program earlier this week. So-called dreamers who received two-year work permits and deportation protections will begin to lose them in six months unless Congress steps in to act. Trump has said he wants to work with Congress, including Democrats, to pass a bill that addresses DACA recipients before that time. He called Pelosi earlier Thursday and made the comment about the DREAM Act then, as well as in a meeting on Wednesday, according to Pelosi. After their phone conversation, Trump tweeted to say Dreamers should not worry about being detained over the next six months, which a Democratic aide said that Pelosi requested he say publicly. The White House did not immediately respond to a request for comment on the conversations. Democrats in the House and Senate called for a vote on the DREAM Act in September and said they are prepared to attach the legislation to other bills until it passes. Earlier this week, lawmakers opened up an informal restriction on co-sponsorship of the bill they were allowing members to sign on only in Democrat-Republican pairs and expect the number of backers to go up significantly in the House. Pelosi predicted it would pass in the House if it was allowed to go for a vote. That would depend however, on whether House Speaker Paul Ryan, R. Wisconsin, allowed it to go for a vote. He said Wednesday that he wanted to pair Dreamer legislation with border security. The same goes for the Senate, where Senate Majority Leader, R. Kentucky, has previously opposed the DREAM Act and other immigration bills that would grant legal status to undocumented immigrants. Pelosi said she believes Trump will demand border security measures as part of a DREAM Act package, but not a wall. We now have four Republican co-sponsors. We need more, Schumer said. There are many on the floor, in the Senate, who seem to be sympathetic to the DREAM Act. Maybe the president can help them get to co-sponsor.